today I'm going to um, make a simple two-page layout for um, my file of cat. Um, not file of cat, but the, the day timer. And so I want artwork in the day timer. So I'm going to put a little artwork in here. I'm going to start by um, put some putting some reinforcement tabs and it doesn't matter which color you use just um, anything will do really as long as it kind of reinforces the holes and um, helps them to be, to not tear when the artwork's on here and it, it has a little bit more weight to it than a normal just a piece of paper so, so it's gonna <coughs> help you from not losing your work. going to, I'm thinking about putting a background of these old um, tags from from Casey and Company. I like these. I just wish that this was at both, I was thinking maybe I could do like a, a tab for my, my book, but um, we'll see. But anyway, so and some of these. Oh, that's too. That's oh, it's kind of like so. Just for some texture underneath the. Oh, let's put the blue up here. And so. Yeah, I think I'll use that. I'm just using regular old Elmer School Blue. Because, I don't know, I just, I'm not trying to archive this or anything, so I'm just gluing it down. Anywhere it goes. Sorry about the dog. So upset I'm missing the nail. Oh well, I'll fix it later. So just put these down real quick. I happen to like the quiet, so, I mean, I don't love the quiet, but I like it.
thinking out loud. This is going to be the grab. I guess. Let's see what you're going to say. Now, some of this is going to um, curl up at the edges. But it's okay because this is this is um, art journaling, and in art journaling you can do whatever you want. You can make a mess if you want to. So I'm gonna let this dry for a while, and then I will come back and we will need um, acrylic paint or watercolor, whatever you prefer, and. Um, paintbrush, water, so, yeah, I'll be back.